today. That's a glorious morning. Gonna be a warm one. Um, Siggy's inside, she's got the vacuum cleaner going, she's vacuuming. The air conditioner's on in the house. And, uh, yeah, we've got plenty of power, so we're using it. Isn't that right, mister? Isn't he gorgeous? He's an old gentleman now, isn't he? All right, today, I've been waiting for these cables for such a long time. Um, my new, these are meant to be double shielded, uh, Cat 6A. Um, now for a lot of you out there who are wanting patch cables, you'll notice there's a whole heap of different A's and E's and all that sort of stuff at the end of this patch, at the end of the 6 because they used to be just Cat 6. Now they are backwards compatible, okay? Um, so don't get confused when you go to buy patch cables. Now this one's double shielded. It's got the metal shield there and it's also got the cable um, shielded. So it's a double shielded cable. And there's its information, okay. Um, I'll turn some fans off in the shed here so you can hear what I'm saying. But basically, what I'm doing is replacing these old, really old cables that I had um, with the Cat 6A cables. So those of you that are watching me live view Online, we'll notice that um, you just lose information for a minute or two. They're, they're the noisy fans, those ones up there. They shift a lot of air out of my shed, a lot of air. And of course, then we've got these fans down at the bottom here that suck the cooler air in from underneath the uh, veranda. Okay, I'm going to um, slip these covers off and uh, get these on. It's a pretty simple job. And plug it into the computer. Be back shortly. By the way, uh, before I undo the covers on the Classic, I'm going to be doing AD first. I do just simply go in to AD, turn it off there, that's I got the solar turned off, and then I pop this fuse down the bottom. And uh, that way it just means I don't get any shorts or anything while I've got the cover off in case I bump it, you know. Okay, so I got the cover off this one. So basically we just Reach in there, uh, unclip this one. Pull him out the bottom. And we plug the new one in. Um, I need two hands for that, so I've got to put the camera down, but that's basically it. And then I just run it around and plug it in to the computer there. Okay, so that's got them both done. So what we do now is, um, some people think these arc and spark and carry on when you close them, alright? You get them and you close them firmly like that, and there's no arcs and no sparks. And then we just turn this solar back on, and that's it. And um, Now it's got double shielded cables on, they were very stiff by the way. They weren't loose and floppy like the um, other Cat 6 cables. I guess that's the shielding in them um, that makes them so stiff. So just use gentle curves if you get the double shielded cable like I've got. And um, no severe bends and you'll be fine. Alright, there we 
go. Um, it should be goodly goodly. I just love this computer. It, gives, it just allows so many options and so much for testing here. It's awesome. It's awesome. Uh, and it's fairly warm today. Like I said, the air conditioner's on and the shed door's been shut all day. But it doesn't matter. 45C. Very acceptable. Very acceptable. Uh, considering it's almost, what's that, 33 there? Or 86 Fahrenheit. 33 Celsius, 86 Fahrenheit. Alright. Um, lovely job. Uh, uh, got rid of some of the mess under there. You just, you're going to have, okay, like I mean, I'm sure I could, I could take these off and put them away, but then I have to take the face off the units if I need to um, update their uh, system. Um, so I just leave them plugged in, you know. And you're always going to need the battery temp sensor cable. And if you use the whiz bang, you're going to have the whiz bang cable. So, you know, I mean, I have cut down a lot on the cabling in this shed. Uh, those of you that remember, I had a heap of communications cables over there. But God, it was a mess. It really was a mess. Um, well, they've, they've all been replaced thanks to this computer. And it's 5 gigahertz Wi-Fi. Awesome stuff. Alright, keep safe everyone. Again, have a great Christmas. Great Christmas holidays. I hope uh, you all have a good new year too in case I don't put another video up till, till then. Alright, bye from us. Yeah.